Ben, from the world's smallest lab, here's an interesting quick little demo about how a the generator floating generator coil goes from a drain to a source. Sitting here with nothing happening, the motor not running, the capacitor has reversed charged at 0.367 volts as shown on the meter on the left. And this subtracts from the rail voltage and the battery that drives this is about 12.5 something volts. And so you see the difference. The motor only sees 12.2 volts now. When I give this a spin, you'll see the voltage on the left actually go higher to the negative for a moment as it's reverse charging harder. But as the generator effect kicks in and the generator becomes a source, the voltage will go positive and you'll see the rail voltage on the right start increasing also. So here we go. I'm giving it a spin right now. Now. See it going higher? Now the motor is spinning up, and as it spins up, see the voltage drops, goes through zero, and now the generator effect is starting to take over and adding to the battery voltage on the rail. And you can see it, it'll ramp on up to about uh, four and a half to five volts eventually. But this is a quick demonstration of this uh, drain versus source effect that was mentioned. And if the generator is not able to supply the current, you would never see it go into the positive range. And you can hear this thing winding up over here. But anyway, just wanted to show you folks that. Take care.